What is going on? I just got back from a uh, backpacking trip, just a single overnighter, um, with my dog, and uh, we went to Horton Creek again. Um, that's why I'm not posting any videos or pictures or anything because it's uh, you've seen it. <laughs> but I got to test out, or I sh should say, Ted got to test out rather his new backpacking harness. He has a harness with side satchels on it. He got to carry his own food, his silicone collapsible bowls, and his own sleeping bag. Yeah, he has a sleeping bag now. So it's a dog sized sleeping bag um, with a little hood and it has a cinch on it. And uh, he got to test that out and he liked it. So um, I get to carry less weight and he gets to carry his own weight and look super cute. He got lots of uh, compliments. Um, as we were heading up the trail, everyone that was passing us, so um, they thought he was really cute with his with his own little backpack there. Um, even a car a car stopped as we were leaving the parking lot, going to the trailhead. Um, a car slowed down, stopped, and I was like, "What's going on? Why is this car stopped?" And the window rolled down, and this girl yelled out the window. She's like, "Your dog has a great backpack!" And then drove off. And I was just like, "You hear that, buddy?" So he's uh. He's getting uh, more gear. But the reason I'm making this video is because I got back today <clears throat> and I got a new box from Karen. Um, I used to subscribe to Karen um, and I looked at my membership history and my membership history said I canceled in 2015. So that was a long time ago. Um, but there's still things that I use from those subscription boxes to this day. And even this weekend, something I used um, quite a bit this weekend actually because a lot of the wood was damp and I had to keep getting the embers going and dry out the wood um, but this uh, pocket bellows uh, and what this is and I got this from a box a long time ago and I still use it all the time as you can see this thing's a little dirty I use it quite often but it's telescoping metal tube and it takes all your breath and narrows it down into a nice little stream and you can just light those embers up like a like a like a blacksmith's forge <laughs> but uh, it's great I love it so I thought I would um, resubscribe because some things have happened since uh, last time I subscribed um, outside magazine or outdoors magazine I don't remember what you, you know what I'm talking about big yellow letters uh, they have either purchased Cairn um, or somehow partnered up with Cairn. I'm not sure which, but uh, that's what's happened. So let's see what's inside this box. All right, we have... Mrs. Potts, 24 ounce, 709 milliliter aluminum pot, hard anodized, three ounce. Well, that's kind of cool. Oh, and it comes with a handle. So I was wondering, this does not have a handle, but it does say designed for handle. Well, here is a handle for it. So this uh, allows you to pick up anything, it looks like. And it has some other features. Um, pot gripper, fuel canister recycle tool. So this has, right here, it has some kind of threaded thing on the handle. Um, how do, uh, let's see here. Screw nut on the fuel canister, press down on the handle, and oh, whoa, you screw this down on the top, and then you press down on the, this like punctures the canister. And then I guess that means that canister can now be recycled. I guess you can't recycle the canister once it's empty, because I think there's still a little bit of fuel in there, and it's probably under pressure, but this, I guess safely ensures can is empty oh ensure can is empty before puncture do not puncture around open flames 
So it just allows you to, I guess, safely, I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of a neat feature, but I like the fact that it has a handle and you can grab things. Um, that's actually something I've ran into that's a problem uh, with a lot of cooking pots and other things that don't have a designated handle. Or even when they do, you still got to like get a handkerchief or something to grab the handle because it's hot. So um, that's cool. That way you can just grab things. Let's see, what else do we have? Stasher, the plastic-free usable storage bag that you can cook in. Huh, plastic free. The healthier alternative to plastic, pure platinum silicone. Okay. Dishwasher, microwave, fridge, freezer, stove top. Enjoy four star flavor. Oh, hmm. You put in like a. Oh, you could like sous vide something in uh, boiling water um, oven. So let's see. Oh, it's just a little silicone pouch. That'd be a very small sous vide meal, but I mean, you know, if you say you have something, throw it in a pot of boiling water. Um, but that's kind of nifty. At the moment, I don't see myself using this, but I know that I will eventually use it and then be happy that I have it. Um, and then find more, you know, reasons to keep using it. Uh, that's how a lot of the gear that I've had over the years for my Karen box, I got too much gear and that's why I canceled my subscription in 2015. But since then, I found that I'm using stuff that I thought I'd never use. Um, and this is probably going to be one of them. If nothing else, it's a nice little silicone food stash or reusable because I go through Ziploc bags like a fiend and I feel like I know like they probably get recycled, you know, but at the same time, it's just so wasteful. So this is a nice reusable alternative. And then, oh, this stuff I love and I use it quite often. I buy it um, on Amazon. Uh, Four Sigmatic Mushroom Coffee Mix. This is their, with Lion's Mane, I think. Um, they use a lot of uh, mushrooms that are, that promote um, brain function and um, kind of like cognitive function and you'd think with how much I drink this stuff I wouldn't have such a hard time stumbling on my words right now but uh basically think of um what is the word that I'm thinking of I need this obviously I haven't had any mushrooms in a while my cognitive functions are declining uh neuro Anyway, <laughs> they promote good brain health. I clearly need it. It's been a long time since I've had it. Um, so, Four Sigmatic Mushroom Coffee. And then what else do we have in here? Karen Scout. This looks like a little... Oh, okay, I see. I see. It looks like a little newspaper, but it is detailing the things that um, have, have come in it. There's the pot, there's the handle... Uh, there's the four sigmatic, cof sigmatic coffee and the little stasher bags. Um, and then, ooh, a little recipe for cowboy, camp cowboy coffee. Um, just some advertisements and other news. That's kind of cute. Um, I feel like they've reduced the amount of items that you get or maybe that these are kind of premium items so they you get less but um that's four four items pot handle coffee stash bag maybe it was always four items i don't know i i feel like i used to get much more in these but these are some pretty cool items so that is the cairn box um, I think I'm gonna keep the subscription at least for another month see what happens see what else I get uh, And I have so much gear as it is and I'm actually going towards ultralight gear um, to do more backpacking stuff with but Gears always great. So um, You know, this will be nice. I will use it in pair with the handle that it comes with but I look forward to seeing what's in the uh, what's in the next box. Until then, oh, one last thing. I got my beanie and I just took it out on an adventure. Um, I 
wanted to have my logo for my channel on a beanie and I'm also going to make a hat. Maybe some other stuff, I don't know. I have no intentions of ever selling it because that's um, not what I'm about. I'm not trying to grow this channel to do anything except for be here for my own personal pleasure and uh, and, and just getting a way to, to get what I like to do out. Um, I'm not trying to get sponsored. I'm not trying to sell merch. Um, in the past, I've done some things that require a lot of self-advertising and uh, self-promotion, and I, I just didn't like it. I don't like self-promotion stuff. I feel gross. I feel gross advertising myself. Um, so this is just for me. Uh, and my as well my hat or any other gear that I put my logo on um, just for me but uh, yeah so that's new anyway that's all for today take care and see you next time